North Carolina Prepper here. Today I want to talk to you about building a roll-up J-pole antenna. These are good for your bags, for camping, for whatever. They're cheap and they're pretty much disposable. Once you put it up you can just cut the line or yank it down or whatever it doesn't matter. Uh, they're pretty fun and easy to make. This is actually more than you need to create right here. <clears throat> I got a soldering iron off to the side you can't see but Let's talk about the roll-up J-pole antenna for 2 meters and I guess 442 because that's harmonic. We're going to need about 60 inches here. We're going to need 60 inches of antenna twin line antenna leads. So um, let me unroll this here. <coughs> I have a bunch of these made up because I uh, I help out at the ham radio club and we give these to kids as their first antenna project to make. So this is already pre-measured out. This is 60 inches. <clears throat> first thing we're going to do is we're going to take and cut the end here. I'm going to get that off the desk. We're going to cut this and solder the two ends together in a lead. So I'm going to put these together. And I'm going to go ahead and solder these two together at the bottom. OK. Since the soldering doesn't work well, I'm going to do some of that off cam with my uh, soldering thing. So we got that. Now, <clears throat> once I've got that together, I need to move up um, 16 and 7 eighths inches up the lead here. So let me measure that. From the solder point, we need 16.7 inches. Mark that with the pen. There we go. Now we're going to cut a notch in one of the connectors, just one. It's going to be a quarter inch cut. This will be part of the, this is why it's a J pole because it's not actually connected. So we'll cut there. And a quarter inch more. So we got here. And I'll take the knife here. Just cut that little section out. And that makes the actual J pole. So now we have a J pole. Now, okay, so let's set this aside now. This is just a piece of coax I cut for demonstration purposes. We're going to go ahead and strip this. Okay. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to connect the center connector or center conductor to the long length, the 60 inch length of uh, braid. Not to the opposite side of the notch. So let me get that back up on for you. And let me, well, first I got to um, cut a notch here, one and a half inches up. Forgot about that. We're going to strip, well, we're not going to cut a notch, we're going to strip the shielding off it. From the conductor. Right here is going to be our connection points. So, 
Let me go ahead and do that and I'll be right back. I'll strip it up and I'll be right back. Alright, as you can see, I just pretty much burned that off. So, we're going to connect the center lead. Okay. We're going to connect the center lead to the left hand side. So, let's do that now. Okay. As you can see, that's been soldered. Now, to secure it, I'm going to slip a piece of, well, that's not long enough. I'm going to slip a piece of heat shrink tubing over it, about that much. Now let me do that. There we go. And I will turn off my fan. And I'll go ahead and shrink it on down. I'll get that a little tighter. Now this won't be waterproof, but it'll hold on there real well. And it'll be pretty good. There you go. Now you just put whatever end you want on here for your radio, a BNC, a BL259, or 254, I forget what it is, but screw on, or whatever. You just put whatever cord you want on in here. And then you have your notch here. That's your uh, that's part of your J pole there. That's what actually makes a J pole. Now, what you do now after you do that, you get that on your radio. You hook it up to a meter, and then you start cutting off a quarter inch at a time to tune it. And that's basically it. And then you punch a little hole in the end here and put a piece of thread or loop and hang it from a tree or a high spot, and that's it. That's a roll up. J pole. Let me roll it up here. Yeah. What's whatever cord you need on there? Just roll it up, throw it in your bag, and you have an emergency J pole antenna that you can get a pretty high altitude. And a poor man's linear is height equals range. So there you go. North Carolina Prepper, real quick, easy J pole antenna. Okay, please rate, subscribe, have a great day.